Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and this is Coffee here, and then I'm going to start doing coding tutorials, and first off, I'm going to do what a lot of people usually struggle with for some reason, and I actually struggled with it before because I under didn't understand the concept, but yeah, so we're actually going to go onto my website, or at least the code for it. Yeah, this is it because you know this this is like basic website I kind of made yesterday. So if we do go on dev, wait for it to open, then I go on my browser, localhost, and yeah, this is made with Next JS, but it works the same as React as it's built on React. Now this is a nav bar, this is a sidebar, this is the page, and this is the footer. As you can see right here, the layout is how it's going to be. Now in React, you could have used React Reader DOM to do all this. Uh, I just used the layout for for this because it does layout and then the component of inside. So in the layout is the navigation bar as the header, the sidebar is the sidebar, uh, the children as the content which is the page. Because if I do slash about as well, it takes me to the about page and then the home page. <coughs> In the footer right here now we're going to add something uh, below the home being like I don't know uh, well I guess you could say social media so what we're going to do is you can make your own component file and we're going to name it socials.js then you also want to install the extension ES7 React Redux GraphQL React Native Snippets. It is amazing. Now, after that, you want to do RAFC, and it creates a uh, component for you, so you don't have to type it all out, and a stateless React component. And in the socials, it does this for you, everything. Export, cons, everything. You can just do H1 socials or maybe just an h4 and then yeah you see it's not even on here right even if you refresh it's not on there what you want to do is go to the layout then you can import socials and then after this we can just do a, a dot uh, socials and do socials slash there we go that's where the socials are and that's how you make a component that you can use anywhere you could even say it multiple times see and there's your component if you wanted to make like a, a socials but you only wanted to show on some pages you could go to the layout and put it on here for every page or you can go to let's say the home page and do import socials and then after home, we can put the socials. <clears throat> and there we go. Now it's below. Now you want to know how it's different. If we go to the about page, it's not on there. But on the home page, it is. And that's how you make a component you can use anywhere, whenever. Thank you for watching. This has been Coffee with how to make a React component. See ya.